trying to see what I'm doing here. I'm trying to get the gravel in. Can you kind of see what's going on? So it's going up under the rock. But it's still a waterfall. Oh, it's filling up. There it is. It looks dang good. This is actually a purple light, which I did not know. been like two days ago since i actually dug this out but basically i went and got the pond liner as you can see right there 10 by 13 foot the last one was 7 by 10 now also i want to I'm gonna show you guys something right here on the creek uh what, what the kind of system i'm gonna run here the water uh, from the waterfall the spillway will spill over onto that rock and it will go all the way down to there now also you guys as far as fish that are going to go in here i'm going to have a bass a gar a catfish uh and a pleco and maybe some other type of fish now my bass tank i know i said i'm getting i was going to get another bass for it and all that but the bass that i'm going to get uh the next bass that i get it will go in here and it won't go in that tank because that bass tank is actually going to be a soft shell turtle tank now you know it's, it's pretty deep water only thing i got to make now is the basking area uh actually that big piece of driftwood that was in that bass tank is going to go in here i actually got it out also that power head uh, that was in that tank it's got to go in here as well i've made it to where i think i can put it in here it, it can add a lot of circulation and uh, a lot of flow in here so basically that's pretty much it uh i gotta first things first really we got everything ready i'm gonna get some of these leaves out of here first and then we'll open this liner up and get it down in here okay so i got it in here now i was trying to go around the edges and trying to really you know get the edges really tight and all that here's something really interesting though it doesn't quite fit all of that so I'm going to actually have to use some of my old liner, which is okay. I kind of planned on doing that uh, to make this creek system just right. But now one thing I'm going to get in here and do that I did not do with the last pond build. The, the last pond build, I just went ahead and took the rocks. I got the liner in there, got it kind of flattened out and straightened. And then I started going around the edges. That is a mistake because what happens is it starts to pull the liner up. And all of a sudden, uh, your edges are not as, not as straight as you wanted them. So what I'm going to first do is actually get in there with the small rocks and go around the edges of the pond and that will hold the liner into place when I go around the outside of the pond with the big rocks. So let's do it. Just like that. Go around the edges. Kind of see what I'm doing here. Boom. There we go. We're about at the ledge. I think that'll be the last rock at the ledge. Kind of come down here. It's a little bit of a hump right there. We had to put that there because a giant root. I'm gonna tighten this up a little bit. No creases. There we go. Now I've got to go along the the ledge right here and put some which uh when i get done actually done with the liner i don't know if i actually have to leave these here or not but for now i'm gonna put them here so that way it doesn't crease over the ledge and there it is check it out the gravel in. That it's actually, it's coming out the back right here, but that won't happen when the hose is on here. Yeah. You can kind of see what's going on, so it's going up under the rock, but it's still a waterfall. So I'm going to let it fill up, probably going to let it fill up to about like that halfway mark, mm -hmm. kind of almost the ledge, and then uh, I'm going to pump the water back out and then put actually fresh water in here. Still going to probably need like at least four to five bags of pea gravel to go around the pond and over there and stuff, but for now, I think I can get this thing going. We're gonna get the drift fluid and also the circulation pump. We're gonna let the water's drain it out right now. We're gonna fill it back up and get this thing going. There we go, so got the drift wood in. We got the two pumps right there, the circulation pump and that pump, and then we got all of our wiring or ran back here beside uh behind this right here. There's the filter, we got both of the tubing plugged into there, or you know, basically into the 
filter and then the thick tubing runs under that rock and that right under there is uh, where the spillway is at. Spill over, it does not go over the rock, which is okay. It goes up under the rock and makes it on its own little waterfall. Then over there, that is an LED light that's gonna point at the waterfall creek area. And I'm gonna get another one that points to the pond. There goes the pump. So the pump came on. Let's see if it starts circulating. Let's see if that starts working. Oh, it's filling up. Here it comes. It's coming. There it is. At first, this was kind of tilted and it wasn't very even, but we were able to get it even with uh, uh, second some rocks around that so that way you could have this big top piece over that uh so you know you know kind of hiding it a little bit but flows over to the end of the creek and then flows under that rock into the pond and there's a circulation pump you can see slowly but surely circulating the water back around to the other pump the actually pump that sucks it up underground to the filter and then back to the waterfall so now uh obviously need a lot more pea gravel to go around the pond and also a little more in the pond and then also uh gonna plant some plants back here and also a little bit on the sides but also got this LED light right here got one pointing towards the waterfall in the creek area and I got another one if I want to use it to point actually to the, towards the pond and also gonna be getting an LED uh, light to go inside of the pond so you can like you know see in the water a lot better so basically you guys I'm gonna come back out here in a little while from now and I'm gonna show you guys what this LED looks like I'm actually gonna see it for myself for the first time uh, and actually I might get the other LED and plug it up have it going straight on the pond and then have that one up there on the waterfall creek system area. Let me show you some work that I got done that I haven't really go, uh, went into detail about. Basically, uh, we have the pump that goes to uh, the filter and we have the uh, circulation pump right here that run underground and right up in there is where all the plug-in stuff is at. You got it covered over rocks and you, you can sit down on this right here, over like this right here in the pond and that runs back. And then we have another cord that runs back around here all the way around to the light over there we got the filter right here the tubing from the pump comes out under comes out of the pond runs underground to there got the thick tubing right there and it runs to the waterfall right there so basically i need about five more bags of pea gravel or so to go around the pond and, uh, and over there and stuff and a little bit to go inside of the pond and then i'm also going to go in and plant the plants tomorrow but uh you guys will see all that in uh another video so i'm gonna wait a few hours before it get dark and i'm gonna come on back out here first guys so it is now a few hours now i'm literally uh holding my phone right here it's light because it's like it's no light my, my camera does not pick up light very well but i want to show you guys the pond really quickly uh, you can tell it looks dang good. This is actually a purple light, which I did not know. The other one is a white light. Got a little tiki thing going back there. Got another right there. I didn't like that one. Anyways, guys, just want to kind of show you guys this uh, before I uh, ended off the video. But anyways, guys, that is the end of the video. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please just drop a like on the video. Make sure you guys subscribe if you're new to the channel. I'm going to get some more pea gravel and also plant the plants around this pond tomorrow. But anyways, guys, with that being said, guys, I will see you all in the next video. Peace. Close it out just then. Anyway, peace.